what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back we are here once again with some more slam dunk reactions just gonna jump into it man because to be honest i don't remember these names i could look him up because i did write them down but i do know that our main character is going up against the girl's um brother which is the captain of the basketball team okay so i i know where we're at <laughs> okay as i was supposed to do the rest of these reactions the same day but i didn't get to okay so i'm pretty sure you guys are sitting out with just two episodes right now wondering what's going on <laughs> you know what i'm saying there's a possibility of that but in any case man i'm recording this on a different day so we're just gonna jump in and see because i'm excited to see what is so great about slam dunk because you got it came highly recommended from all the sports anime fans and i wanted to do a sports anime after i did haikyuu of course you guys know the how the channel works already we do um you know one anime from each genre if we can you know what i'm saying we always have a classic going on a sports anime going on and a modern anime going on i still haven't picked which modern anime i want to do on the channel yet um but we'll get there you know what i'm saying right now we're still doing we're catching up with jojo so um but i don't want to count jo um um jojo's stardust Cru crusaders as the modern on the channel because it was not in that category you know what i'm saying plus we're still doing full metal alchemist so i'm probably gonna wait until i finish full metal alchemist to jump into a modern anime okay so we can have four running on the channel at all times okay so we're just gonna jump in man and see what slam dunk has to offer um i did try to upload slam dunk um to youtube but it it, it wasn't flying <laughs> it wasn't flying so this is definitely going to be on the google drive of course so let's jump into this and I will see you guys for the review. All right, so that was Slam Dunk episode three and four, guys. Hope you guys check that out. Enjoy the reaction. <laughs> it's so funny the things that they're you know doing in this anime it's just the the main character is really funny um you know he's trying to make the basketball team after you know what i'm saying making one good move on the captain and as they pointed out you know hit being a foul it is a foul what he did was a foul you can't do that like <laughs> you can't do that what he did was a foul um you know what i'm saying so you know but it was incredible to see what he did because i mean he got the ball snatched in mid-ear right and then he took the ball back from him and dunked it on him so that's pretty cool it was pretty cool to see there were no rules so um so yeah street ball rules you know what i mean so i enjoyed the, those two episodes um for what they were it wasn't anything like too out of the pocket where you didn't understand what was going on or anything like that um you know what i'm saying we are watching a sports anime so you're not gonna see anything i don't think you're gonna you're gonna see very inspiring things more than anything in sports anime that's the most important thing that they kind of drive home you know what i'm saying and it's gonna be hard it's it, it's you know what i'm saying like they are sports anime out there um and i know you guys have watched a ton of sports anime you know um that you guys have recommended on the channel um but it's, it's gonna be hard because ippo is still number one even though i've seen haikyuu haikyuu is, is not on that level for me it's a it's a great anime don't get me wrong but it's not on ippo's level and to see that a more modern sports anime does not have i wouldn't think that it could hold the coattails of it of a classic anime like like ippo you know what i mean and it's not because i enjoy boxing more than i enjoy volleyball you know what i'm saying it's not even that it's just the overall cut 
off the story, Ippo just does a better job of telling a, a, a story and to let you feel more than Haikyuu does. There's a lot of great moments in Haikyuu, but you don't get those moments consistently throughout the anime. And this is, as I said, no knock on the anime because I did up until like from season one to three, I gave Haikyuu a nine out of 10. You know what I'm saying? I gave it a nine out of 10. This is my review on the things that I look at. You know what I'm saying? Some people might be biased. Some people might say that it's better than Ippo. Not for me. You get what I'm saying? So everybody has their different experiences with anime. It's not like, you know what I'm saying? As I said, I'm not, you know, dunking. I don't want to say dunking, but on Haikyuu. But I want to see, you know, something up to Ippo's standard. Like, it's what I want to see, but it's not probably what I'm not going to get because Ippo is probably one of the greatest sports anime of all times and it's kind of hard you know what I'm saying I don't want to be in comparison I want to watch shows for what they are and give them a proper rating from what I used to give um, shows proper rating so four episodes into Sam Dunk I'm intrigued but this is basic stuff you get what I'm saying it's, it's a basic beginning it's funny a lot of funny moments in this anime um, where you can laugh out loud, bust out laughing. I don't know if there's ever going to be a moment, you know what I'm saying, in this anime where I'm going to feel so much emotion. And that's, that's where Ippo grabs you. You get what I'm saying? And the difference between Hit and I and Haikyuu. You get what I'm saying? Because you don't really get a sense of that is going to go in that direction. There may be moments there where you feel emotional in Haikyuu, but it was never like, like I was, there were moments in Ippo I was like, boo-hoo crying. You guys saw how I was at the end when I when I finished watching, I was doing the review. I couldn't even do the review properly because I was crying. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Because, um, and even now I'm, you know, going into the, you know, into the manga and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing what Slam Dunk is going to offer, if he's going to have moments like that in this anime. And I think that's what differentiates Ippo from, you know, say a Haikyuu and, you know what I'm saying, I'm not far enough into this to give it, you know, any kind of ratings or anything, but I'm hoping that it goes somewhere in that direction where, you know what I'm saying, it's not just an enjoyable anime, you know what I'm saying, because um, I love those, don't get me wrong, I love Haikyuu. You know what I'm saying? I am going to be doing part two of season four when it's when it starts to drop. I think it's next month if I'm not mistaken. So I'm definitely looking forward to watching that um, because it's a hype anime. It's a hype anime, um, but it's still yet to be seen with Slam Dunk. I will be doing two more episodes here, um, so make sure you check those out when they drop tomorrow. Okay? So I appreciate y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching Slam Dunk. Appreciate y'all, man. And I will catch you guys later. Peace. Don't forget to like the video and comment.